I'm Jamie Eason and this is Dr. Dan Gartney. And Dan, hey, I'm so excited because I have this new product. Um, I don't know if you've seen it, but uh, it's a peanut protein and it's actually made from defatted peanuts. And the thing I love about it is you can make it into a shake, you can make it into a spread, sprinkle it on yogurt. It's really versatile, um, but I, I love nut butters. I kind of overdo it. So this way I can control the amount of fat, the amount of calories. Um, but let me ask you, um, how how good of a, a protein source is this? Is this something that I can use, you know, to just supplement my protein and, and have this in lieu of other foods? You know, I, I get excited when I see your product. I've seen it because my wife uses it when she cooks too, awesome. and it's always <laughs> something great when she's making it. Um, that's a hint in case you're watching. Chris. It's good. <laughs> yes, I promise. Um, peanuts are a legume, a nut. Um. And they're great sources of protein for people that, especially for people that are vegetarian, vegan. Um, as ter in terms of a complete protein, they lack a little bit, so you wouldn't want your diet to be completely nut-based. I can't eat peanut butter all day. Well, I, I did as a kid, so I, I made it. <laughs> you know, but it's possible. Okay. Um, for especially for an athlete, and especially for someone worried about aging effects. You want to have a lot of uh, sulfur-based amino acids because you have a very important antioxidant called glutathione that's dependent upon cysteine levels. And also selenomethionine is another antioxidant. So the science of what you need, the peanut proteins could not give you as the sole source of your protein. Okay. If someone had to put an absolute answer down there, that would be it. Now, can it be a great protein to supplement? Absolutely. Just like um, soy, it can be a very wonderful uh, protein. Not so much maybe for athletic enhancement, but certainly in terms of getting in a quality protein. And as you stated, it's one that's really pretty tasty. Right. And it's also one that um, prepares well, because I know I never get called in to help when my wife's making it, so that's another reason I really love it. <laughs> um, one issue about the peanut protein versus peanuts that maybe is one of the reasons people have steered away from peanuts is peanuts are usually a little bit higher in some bad fats. Right. And they don't compare as well to like walnuts and almonds that get all the, the fanfare of the, the nut club. That, sorry for the, the nut, nut club, club out there. <laughs> um, the pro, peanut protein powder, and correct me if I'm wrong, but it's defatted. Yes, it is. So all the fats are removed in the processing of getting the protein out of the peanut and into the bag. So what you're left with is really what you're looking for in terms of a protein supplement. And it works great for that either as a, a just a stirred in blended drink or as a cooking ingredient. And I'm pretty sure that I've seen that you put out a number of uh, videos Oh yeah, this. I made a Thai peanut sauce too that it's really good. So if, if, it's, if a sweet tooth is not your thing, I got you covered in a lot of ways. So. We're ready when you got the invitation. <laughs> so. It's really good. Well, that's that's great information because I'm, I'm really proud of it and I wanted people to understand how it fits into their diet because um, you know I, I still take my, you know, my whey proteins and my isolates, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, but I'll add a scoop of that or um, my son loves it. I'll put it in yogurt for him and he's not even two yet he'll clear that out in a heartbeat I don't get any <laughs> but um so yeah there's there's a lot of great options for it it's so versatile so I think you know I think I hope a lot of people will get it just because there's so many great things you can do with it, it tastes awesome and like you said you're avoiding some of the bad fats and maybe some of the bad rap that that comes along with the peanut but right. but I can't live without my peanut butter so um, anyway, thanks so much, Dan. Uh, for more information and some great tips on health and fitness, please visit my Facebook at www.facebook.com slash official